In part 5, I forgot to show how to add the pulleys to the motors because that's kind of important um, as to whether or not you get a straight belt path. So watch this video. I'm also going to show a little bit more in detail how I add the belts to the XY. So enjoy. This is the B motor and the pulley sits like this and then the motor goes on to the bracket and the A motor has the pulley the other way around and goes into the bracket like this. On the B motor measure 26 millimeter from the top flange and down to the motor flange. Secure it with some Loctite and add it to the motor bracket. For the A motor you want to measure your pulley because you want the pulley flange to be 5 mm above the motor flange <coughs> add the um, size of the pulley so my pulley is 16 plus 5 is 21 mm I want 21 mm from the bottom and down to the motor flange so secure it again with some Loctite added to the motor bracket secure the motors with m 3 by 8s now a more detailed version of adding the belts so take the lower belt allow around the lower x pulley all the corner pulleys and over to the b motor or over to the, over to the uh, x carrier and then we are going to fit the belt in the loop like this then you can just add the top uh, loop uh, to secure the lower belt as well you can now cut the belt and give it a little bit of length and then we can add it to the loop and then we we want the x-axis to skew a little bit when we do this we want a gap at about four millimeters on the b side and, and then it should be tight on the other side and then we are going to straighten this up when we add the top belt so at the top belt start uh, on uh, the a side around the idler back to the motors around the corner pulleys back to the x-axis and over to the x-carrier and then you can secure it in the loop as well and then you can over tighten the axis a little bit so you will be able to straighten the x-axis it should be the same spacing between the corners and the x-axis so it should be perpendicular to the y-axis this is very important and now you should be done just check that everything runs smooth